Soul Squad, welcome back to my kitchen. Y'all, I am making my Thursday morning breakfast. This is what we eat in the house today. You saw that thumbnail. We are doing um, grits, eggs and cheese, and some crab cakes. That's what's for breakfast this morning, this Thursday morning at Soul Tea House. This is what I'm using right here. This lump crab meat I got from Amazon. So I'm about to make some crab cakes, y'all. We about to get started. Let me open this up. Yes. Welcome to my channel, y'all. Yes, it's one of these days that she ain't showing herself because she don't feel like being on camera. So we gonna, we, we gonna make it through. Y'all gonna like this meal, so you gonna appreciate it. You gonna appreciate the meal, y'all. It's one of them days. I ain't dressed. Okay, guys, I'm going in with my crab meat. This is lump crab meat. I'm not making a lot. This is a quick breakfast for whoever here. They could get some. If they not, oh well. <laughs> well, I'm going to get about four crabs out of here. If I'm making them kind of big, I'm not making no little crabs here. This is a quick breakfast. Joshua at work. Andrew has some, what, little Caesars. And Jackson don't want any crab. So, it just leaves me and Fufu. So, yeah. And I got three cans of crab meat. But you know what? I said, I'm going to save a can. So, as you can tell, I put in mayonnaise. I put in just a regular old mustard. How much? I'll say about two teaspoons. Not a whole lot. Um, yes, I do use breadcrumbs. Uh, progressive. Look, these are breadcrumbs I use. Plain, not the Italian ones. And this is about, I'm going to use about a cup. I'm going to use about a cup. that over there um, and then I like to add obey to my crab meat that's just about it I don't put um, a little bit and add some onion powder A little bit of everything, y'all. Let me grab my garlic powder. Hey, this is the one that got the top on it. When I make something go on the floor, I'll get it. And then I'm just gonna mix it all up together. And this is how I make my crab. As a matter of fact, this means I put my gloves on because I want to get up and oh, it smells good. And this is my crab meat, y'all. I got me some some lemon foil right here. And like I say, I'm going to get a nice size out of them. Nice size of breakfast. So, uh, you know. yeah, I don't get full. Cause those was um little cans. Uh um, so I'm gonna get about four, and it's enough for us today. And I do got another can. But I was like, you know what? I ain't opening up that other can. Yeah, 
There you go. I said four. And your girl got four. Comment below what you're eating for breakfast on Thursday morning. Mm-hmm. Because this is what we about to do. And hair. Hey, I got a pan on the stove. I'm going to use a little bit of vegetable oil today. Not a whole lot. Because cooking crab cakes doesn't take a whole lot of oil. That's about a tablespoon. And we're going to let that get nice. Let that get nice and hot. And we're going to put our crab cakes in there. All right, my pan is nice and hot. I'm going to do two at a time. In here. And let them cook to the golden brown. I have it on the low. Again, not that much grease. It's like a tablespoon and a half. You don't need a lot of grease to make your crab cakes. They smell good and they not even cooked. Just the mustard and the combination of things I put in the um in the crab cake. And I'm using one stove, y'all. <laughs> you know, I told you guys I cook on a lot of stove, but you know what? Just for kangle angle purposes, we're using one burner today. So we're gonna cook the crab cakes first. Then we're gonna let the water boil for the grits, then the eggs. This is how I'm rolling today. I know I could speed it up and use multiple burners, but just for cam our camera purposes and angle, we're going to work. I'm just going to take my time. I'm not in a rush. It's cold outside. The school is um, school was delayed. The school was virtual learning today because of the weather. 100% snow supposed to be coming our way. Uh, we had icy conditions on these streets. And yeah, so I decided to cook a big breakfast. All right, guys, we're going to come back. When it's time to flip these crab cakes so I can show you what they look like on the other side. All right, y'all. Let's flip our crab cakes. Mmm, look at that. That's what I'm talking about. See, that's why I should have got a bigger pan because you need that room to flip. I don't want my crab cakes to break up. If they don't take long to cook, look at them. Looking good. So when we come back, crab cakes are going to be done. The water is going to be on. For what? The grits. Y'all, this is a quick video. I'll put my crab cake recipe below. And this is lump crab meat. And these are just four ounce cans. I got off of Amazon Prime groceries. They were like $8.99 a can. And they four ounces, 4.25 ounces. And they were lump crab meat. Fancy white lump crab meat, wild caught. It's by Crown Prince. And I bought three because they were just wasn't a lot, but I only cooking two. And two got me four. So if I would have did three, I would have got six. So when we come back, the water for the grits is going to be boiling. Okay, so it's called my water is ready for my grits. Now, I use these grits right here. I did a video on making grits before. If I could find the link, I'll put it below. I really don't, I eyeball, that's the air fryer going off, y'all. Jason cooking something in the air fryer. Told you he don't like, um, he don't like um, crab meat. So, I did a video on making grits before um, by following instructions on the back, but I did, um, you know, went off key with the instructions just a little bit, but, um, yeah, so just follow the structure on the back of your grits box. You should have no trouble making grits. I make some nice, smooth, creamy grits. We're going to let this cook. We're going to let them do what they do. 
And when these grits get ready, I'm gonna do my eggs. And I like some soft, fluffy eggs made with butter. And I'm gonna show you guys, I got an egg video too. So long ago. But yeah, let these grits do what they do. Comment below, do you like this food combination? And again, what you're cooking for Thursday morning, or you might be making this for Saturday for the family. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, look at my grits. Nice and creamy. Look at that. Look at the grits. And what I'm about to throw on the nail is this. A half a stick of what? Margarine. And we're going to move this to the side. Now, at this point, if you like cheese in your grits or anything, you go ahead and do what? Put your cheese in it. And I already got my five eggs cracked in, the, in my bowl. Look at the grit. They ready. That's how you like to get the grit thick or just, or just right. All right, and when they sit, they're gonna get a little bit thicker than that. So about to take this off. See that margin all up in there? That's what I'm talking about. Who about to eat good Thursday? My house. All right, guys. My, what I cook? <laughs> my crab cake's done. My grits done. Now I'm getting my pan. I put a piece of unsalted butter in my pan on a medium. Going in with my eggs. Like I told you, I like fluffy eggs. So, when them eggs start coming up, see how they're coming up around the sides? Then you just push them away and push them to the side. They don't take long to cook, y'all. Oh, and I got cheese in my eggs. Go away. I don't do salt, but honey, I do pepper. I do the pepper. This is a quick little Thursday video. I'll be back on camera. I'm making a deal tomorrow. I don't know what now I'm making the pound cake or what. I'm not sure. I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna make tomorrow. I'm not sure. Do I want a pound cake in my life? That is the question. I'm not sure. But whatever video I make tomorrow, the face will be there. Mm. I love cooking my eggs with butter. I'm trying to get y'all real time. Somebody said, this video is so long. She cooking eggs. But I like them fluffy. So do you do cheese or you don't do cheese? And what type of cheese do you do? Shredded cheese, American cheese. I do um, um, white American. I do shredded. And in this, I did um, classic American cheese, five eggs, three pieces of cheese, and some pepper. And look how fluffy, a fluffy egg. Look at that. This is how I like my egg. I don't like nobody's crumbly egg. I'm about to cut the stove off. Bam. That stove cut off. Look at the egg. That's how I like it. Nice and fluffy. All right. Let's make this plate. 
grits, crab cakes, eggs. Who wants some? All right, guys. Like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell to be notified. This plate is hot. Until my next video, go check out who? My Silver Tea Vlogs, Amateur Cooking Guy, my son, and what my sister, New Life Journey. Comment below, would you like to have this for your Thursday morning breakfast? Hit that bell. Mmm. I'm teasing. <laughs>